Hello, this is a series of videos about uh, different books that I'm reading. So these are not really book reviews, but sort of my experiences with them, my impressions and uh, a little bit of spoilers and uh, story reviews. So most recently I've read a novel which is called Conversations with Friends by an Irish writer Sally Rooney. It's uh, an interesting book about a uh, basically a friendship of uh, a couple of young girls and um, a more mature family in their 30s. So just a little bit of a couple of words about uh, Sal Rooney. So she's an Irish writer, she's very young and uh, I think she's like 26 or something. Um, she published a couple of essays, did a couple of short stories and uh, this is actually her first novel. Uh, she published another novel couple of years ago I think which is called Normal People or something like that which was made into a TV show for who so let's talk about conversation with friends and uh, before the book was actually published there was a large commotion about who's gonna win the publishing rights and everybody's were super excited so when I learned about it I wanted to learn more about the writer and read the novel so I could understand what the whole fuss is about so basically it's uh, what you would call a psychological uh, look inside the head of a person who goes through a very, I mean, not to say traumatic, but goes through a lot through her life. So it's a story about uh, uh, the girl whose name is Frances and uh, her friend Bobby. So they're both girls. They used to go out together but now they don't and they just live in Dublin they recite poetry they study in the university they have some kind of internships in uh, publishing or whatever uh, so Frances is not very well off uh, her father is an alcoholic her mother is not working and uh, at least as, as I remember and uh, Bobby on the other hand is pretty well off she doesn't actually need to work so but still they're friends they're going out having fun and uh, during one of those poetic readings that they're doing uh, they actually meet a, a lady who's a photographer and also a writer and she gets very interested into in whatever they're doing and they invite them for dinner so this is how it all starts and uh, uh, it's only the beginning, like a, a first couple of pages of the novel, and um, I'm just gonna give you a little bit of a spoiler warning, and I'm gonna go over the events that go next. So if you don't want to see it, you can just skip it a little bit ahead and learn more about uh, my impressions. So basically, what happens is that they go to see this uh, lady. She has a wonderful flat. Everything is nice. She's also very obviously well. Uh, and doing good for herself and uh, there they actually meet her husband and uh, I think his name is Nick so and uh, basically Francis and Nick start having an affair and it's sort of unusual very strange relationship Nick is sort of a little bit disturbed and uh, Francis as it appears also has a lot of issues so she's uh, she harms herself she's doing a lot of other stuff and uh, their relationship sort of go on and off and we don't actually hear anything apart from the voice of Francis so we don't know actually what her friends or people outside think about it just like in a couple of occasions the other characters have the opportunity to speak so to speak and uh, but the story goes on and on and uh, Frances starts to struggle with a lot of issues it's just she's struggling with this relationship which is not going anywhere because her husband is obviously I mean the her boyfriend is a husband of this older lady and then she also has health problems she also has problems with her parents and it all happens at the same time and uh, I was thinking that in the middle of the novel, closer to the end, she's going to kill herself or something bad's going to happen with her, but uh, no, it's actually worked out pretty well, so if you're 
uh, afraid of reading this because you think it's gonna be like a mess no it's gonna be fine so just go ahead and read it so now I'm just gonna go over my impressions uh, I think it's a very lightly written novel meaning that the subject matter is obviously not very light but the language is great it's very clear almost transparent uh, the writer obviously does very well with uh, psychological prose so she gets into the head of the character and you basically live this encounter and live her life like through her head it's a uh, very engrossing experience like a, obviously nicely written thing so I can understand why the publishers were so excited for the manuscript when they first got it and uh, the story is pretty short it's only like 300 pages and uh, it is also a page turner so you you can actually read it like in one sitting or two sittings so uh, I think I highly recommend it I think it's a good book I wouldn't say it's like a masterpiece or something like that but it's a good thing to learn more about the younger writers and uh, what are they thinking about what do they do and uh, the stories that they are willing to tell thank you so i hope to see you with our next episode